Whoa! Whoa, dude! He's attacking me! Howdy and welcome back to the channel, everybody. We are here at the uh, tree house right now. Good morning, chickens. Good morning, Ebenezer. Today's a very special day because we have some guests in town. I'm talking about the one and only outlaw. I know I told y'all he was gonna be coming down. I mean, he's pretty much the goat of lipping, dipping, country funny riffing. That sounds pretty good. He's got a really, really cool boat that I'm gonna show y'all in a second. And one of the first things that we wanted to do while he's in town is do some bow fishing. He's got a great boat set up for bow fishing and catfishing and all that. A crispy collector on steroids, if you will. And we're gonna be going to a few different lakes this week and doing some different stuff. And did a little pre-fishing yesterday, took LFD out, caught one of the most decrepit post spawners I've ever seen. Check this out. Big and giant. Yes, sir. There we go. Grande Recon, baby. Here we go. Oh, he's skinny. He's all spawned out. Look at him. Dude, I mean, when he hit that thing, it was like, holy cow. Look at that bass. That's ridiculous. I thought he was going to be six pounds when he came up. I'm going to let you go, guy. You need some help. This is the squirrel that keeps coming to the feeder. Do you think I'm gonna feed you right now? Comes to the bird feeder. Well, I think, think he you does. Are? I really think he does. He's like, feed me now, or I'll chew a hole in your house. Look at this. You want some food? Look at that baby. Jeez. That's scary. So, Outlaw's down there. Our boy Outlaw, you know, he's got the widest truck in Texas. <laughs> And during the process of backing in, he uh, he might have overlipped right here. Yeah, I saw that this morning. So um, we went and got some seed, and he's been saying that the best fertilizer ever is the carp. Gabby's telling me that this morning. Do you think it'll work? I think it might work. We've got some severely dry spots in the yard, and we're going to try some natural fertilizer. Okay, we going? We going to see Outlaw? Okay. Come, Come help me. We have the one and only, the goat himself. Amy's gonna help us set up these bows, so I've got a new bow. Uh, Bowtech sent me this thing. I have not used it yet. Outlaw is, uh, he, he knows how to do these things. Yeah. So, I'm a, I'm a dangler, he's a, he's a stabber slash dangler. We're gonna, we're gonna combine them. efforts. We're gonna combine our superpowers today. And we're gonna dangle some stuff for the cats, cats and carps today. Nope, not the oh. sharp stuff. Can you say cat, Emmy? Cat. All right, folks, we're in route. I gotta show you something really cool. Outlaw brought these down. He said I just had to have one. I, I'm in love with these hats. <laughs> so, which one is this called? That's the buck ass. Buck ass? The buck ass. Obviously, you see the antlers right there and a the large mouth. White tail. Look at that, look at that. Look at the, in, the inside's felt too, old school camo. I, I honestly like this next one a little bit better. Uh, because of the camo pattern and I like the name, Trelk. The Trelk. The Trelk. Elk antlers on a trout. If you think I'm not gonna be wearing this while I'm whipping a fly out there in Colorado and stomping around for elks. Yeah, with that long You're crazy. Too, man. Link down below, outlawmerch.com. Outlawmerch.com, link down below. Get you one of these puppies. Let's go stab some fish. And we're here. Let me show you guys this boat. This thing is set up for meat. So first of all, we got the deck. What do you call this stuff? Sea foam? What is this? Uh, hydro turf. Hydro turf. This stuff's really nice on your feet on a nice hot summer day. We've got in-law. Nice. Uh, it's a good shot of him right there. Hello. Platform right here is set up for bow fishing. All the lights on the side are. Uh, super bright so you have 360 light viewer in the middle of the day so you don't need those obviously we welded some hooks there for your bows yo you custom welded these on here yeah that's pretty sweet so on the way over here we just had the bows hanging right now we're doing a little trolling for white bass we're multi fishing trolling for white bass we're gonna set some jugs for cats and then we're shooting shooting fish with bows Hopefully carp. we see some buffalo, carp, grass carp, alligator gar, gar. Def Dead gum, there they are, they're schooling over there. Cruising for the carps. Uh, 
corner of there. I can't see him though. Oh, uh, that might have been a bass there. That's what that was. Yeah. yeah. I didn't see a bass earlier, Saw a black tail. <laughs> Felt the bluegill just tucked way in there. Fishing freaks, I've had a lot of fishing around tires, marinas, things like that. Marina areas, man made stuff. Never bow fished around those areas. So this time of year, all, all these big buffalo carp, they get around the tires and you'll just hear them <laughs> sucking the algae and stuff off of them. So we're gonna cruise on up there in a normal spot I would fish for bass and look for these buffalo, see if we can stab a few. Oh, there's two. Oh, right on his tail. Oh, get him? no. Dang, I saw what? the other one going Just on whizzed him, man. I know. Ah! Oh, oh, we're just on the other side. No, 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 no. It's a big carp right on the other side here. Common. You got this guy? Get him. Get him. That's not a giant bat. No, it's a big. It's a huge carp. Oh, you serious? What the? You missed that broad back beauty? There's one right there on the far tire. Yeah. Think I can get him? Oh, I was way off. Get him. Get it! Oh, God, oh it. no! Turn from me. There's just so many carps in these lakes, man. Yeah. They've just overrun. There's big one right there. Oh, son! Yeah, let's do it. One, two. two. Three. Oh, oh, are what? you serious? What? Mine looked like it went right on his back. I can't. I can't believe we missed that carp. Dude, what happened to us? I don't know. What's going on? I don't like my bow setup at all right now. I just don't like myself. My self setup is not good. What does that duck have babies? Look, the duck has babies. Oh, yeah, look at it. Gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh, dude. That's like the cutest <laughs> thing I've ever seen. A bass could literally eat those. Yeah, they like they're that small. Right now. Oh, wait. We got one here. Yeah. Same one? Yep. Where's he at? Oh, going down. Oh, shoot, I got that. Right on the edge? Dude, I got him. No, oh wait. my gosh, what is that what thing? Is that? Oh my oh gosh. My gosh what what the, the heck? heck? Oh, he came off. He came off? Yeah. What the heck, dude? Dude, it was a screamer. Dude, no way. Yeah. Bro, watch out there. He might come up. I hey, think it could have been a that, big dude? gar. Dude, it could have been a big ass I think that, that's. I think that's what it was. Bro. Oh my God, the thing Did was any scales? screaming drag. Holy no. Dick. Sometimes those blind shots, they work out. That was insane. Yeah. I didn't see that it. was a big boy. I couldn't stop it. I was like trying to hold the. Dude, yeah. That's insane. Let me check your drag. Dude, it, it ran with that. Drag? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Dude, it could have been a really big carp, because I think I saw a fat tail, but I don't know. Oh my gosh! What is that thing? Pull that much drag. It was all the way up. He's coming this side. I think he's gonna come to the gap. He is. Here he is. Right there. See him? One, two, three. Got him. Oh. Did you see it? I had him. It came right out. Dude, I'm in the tire. How does this work? Hold on to that thing. Ow, spiders all over me. Well, this is a debacle here, bud. Uh, my first time getting a tire. I'm hamster wheeling it. Here. Yes. Hey. Yes. Yes. Just a tad tired, right right? I didn't right. think it was going to go through. I'd mind bounced off a couple Big him. Get him. Oh, oh yeah, smoked him. him. Oh, yes. No. He's in the middle. Oh, I'm in there. What do you need to do? Oh, is he going to come through? Is he going to come through? Oh, you're on Get him, man. I think he's taking me through. Nice. Oh, there Good. <laughs> that was sweet. Him. Sniped him from the other side. Oh, we're spooking him. him. Yep. We need that sun. There's one. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh dude, you almost oh, had him. Oh, there's a double one right here. Get him. Oh, oh, dude, I got him. Got him. Oh, got oh, him. come oh, off. Came off. She, they're right. They're getting right. Boy, look, look below you. Oh my. It's like Nestle Quick. Hey, you want to go rope some steers? Oh yeah, look at that. We got a roping dummy in the marina dock. Only in Texas, y'all. I suck at bow fishing. I started out on a really good note, y'all. Really good note. I was, I was like dialed in. I was hitting them, at least nicking them every time. And, these last like 10 shots have just totally sucked. So we got two in there. I think we're gonna go in, we're gonna take a break and we haven't done any type of catfishing yet. We're, we're gonna come back out in the evening because it's so hot here in Texas. Look at that baby duck, it's coming right up to you, dude. Right up to you. Look, look at that. That was funny. Dude. Hey, that's so cute, look at him. He's so cute. Hey, hey. 
Hey, cuties. Little buddies. Little buddies. <laughs> I was just telling these guys I look at ducks in a totally different light now after having one. They're not as majestic. <laughs> You never bow fish it, No, right? I never have. Jared seems to think it's like the deal. It is a deal. So Why do you think I got lights on? I don't know. We're out here during the heat of the day. You tell me. Uh, it's yeah. white down there. Tasty. So the stanch on that is, uh, I think it's going to make good catfish bait. We're going to make some catfish bait uh, out of some of these. And then uh, we're also just going to bury them in the yard. I uh, got some seed to put on top of them. Grow some Make grass. sure if you're going to bury them, get them uh, a couple feet down there. Okay. Because if you got Noted. predators in the area or dogs or something, they're gonna they're gonna dig. We got them, boy. Yeah. We got them back in there. Just did my first filleting on a buffalo. Did the back quarter of it for bait for catfish bait tonight. Oof, it's gross, y'all. Alo says they're good to eat. I don't know what he's eating back home, but it ain't what I'm eating. I mean, I got them fresh crappies in there. I got catfish. I got white bass. Succulent. This stuff is um, a lot of red. A lot of red in it. Anytime you get that, I just, in my experience, gamey. And also, there's just, just like brown juice that comes out of it. Flies like you wouldn't believe coming to this stuff. I mean, it is nasty. I got some seed. I got like a Kentucky bluegrass mix I'm going to put uh, on top of that. And then... We're going to see as an experiment over the next few weeks what comes out of it, if there's anything growing. I mean, you can't make my lawn any worse. <laughs> it's just rocks, dude. There's no nutrients. Straight rocks, man. We got them peaches. Thinking about making a peach cobbler. Steph is. Somehow it's good enough to grow these babies. Look at these nice little peaches. <laughs> Back on the water. Right you ready for this? Yeah, throw a by that. That's how we do it. Or, go ahead and nooch it. We nooched. It's in nooch. Go ahead and back it up the scotch. Just level me out of here. No way. Oh, they're going. Oh my god. Let's get them. Dude. Yep. Yes. Bro. Watch the watch the hooks, hooks in the boat. We got hooks out. They'll eat that 100%. Oh, we're about to get hooked Come up. On, give me this hook now. Oh, got him. Got him. First cast. First cast. You know it. You know it. Yeah, he's not too big. I liked the juicies. Just got rat a tatted. Yeah, they're, they're kind of close to the tire area. Back over there? Yeah. Oh, right at that boat. Oh, right at the boat. Right at the boat. A little tiny. Should have kept that first one. I was like, meh. Well, he got all the hooks. The darkness has occurred. The sun is down. We got jugs out. We got two down already. Two down already, boy. I mean, as fast as we, we couldn't even set the last one, and uh, two, two of them had already we went watched down. The, we watched this one go down. We were just talking about it, like, oh, yeah, these jugs go up when they get hit. You know, they lay flat like this, and when they get hit, don't. It's kind of like a bobber when your bobber does this you know when something's on it doink doink big wigs i'm gonna do the old pull check here see if we got got a taker all right y'all da, 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 da. first kitty cat is in the box we got a channel that's my first fish i've ever got on uh oh he almost got me mm -hmm. first fish i've uh ever caught using drum or or uh Buffalo. Buffalo as bait. So, pretty cool. Caught the, or stabbed him this morning. Circle turned it into a catfish. It's the circle of life, baby. So our plan is we're gonna uh, let these lines soak a little bit more, and while we're letting them soak, we're going to be bow fishing as well. Light this whole area up with the boat. Go ahead and drop that trolling motor in. The popos for the third or fourth time today are raiding the ramps. Don't know ramp what raiders. is going on. Ramp raiding. Dude, this is so cool. Once we get back into some calmer water, it'll be cooler because then everything sticks out. I liked how you've got like the ultimate cat fishing, bow fishing boat. It's like the ultimate food boat. 
food boat, food getter boat. Yeah. And I've got like the ultimate bass boat. Yeah, you've you can got just the... attack. Oh, attack the. I, mean, I don't even have a graph on this boat, man. I know. I do have a graph, but it's sitting in the back seat of my truck. <laughs> it's reading, reading the uh, Wendy's French fries and yep. burrito wrappers. Yep. It's, it's super shallow right here. It's real shallow. Mm. Yeah, your motors. There's one. Uh, oh. 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 Yo, stay in there. Stay in there. He's trapped. It's gonna come out. I see him. Oh, I got him. I got him. Get him. Oh, no, 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 I still got him. I still got him. I got him. He's in the tree, dude. Easy, 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 easy. All right, you're you're in him good. So you're he he's under here now. Try to bring his hat. I'm gonna pull up the motor. What do I do? Here, I'm gonna pull up the motor a little bit. Oh yeah, I see the arrow. I got him. You're in him good. Oh yeah, look at that, look at that. I gotta oh, get you over dude, here. he's tugging. Oh, Jacob, pull up the motor. Pull it. Come here, buddy. Oh. Nice buff, man. That's a good buffy. There you go. Whoa, oh, whoa, dude, careful. he's attacking me. Ah, got you, good. got you. Good. Okay, got one, y'all. First oh, one of the out. night, first one of the night, got him out of a tree like a daggum eight pounder flipping him. Big old fork stump. That was fun. You got a catfish caught and a puppy in the boat. Right Trash. Now this is like rocky. But... Oh god! Oh, oh dude! Nose. Get! Oh! Oh my line was all oh, caught up. Oh shoot! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh! Oh, oh, my, oh my gosh! Oh! I missed him, and he's still there. <laughs> I'm not even gonna Why try. are they sitting like that? Oh, the turtle Turf. sleeping again. There's one right on top of the tire. Oh yeah. Get him, one, two. Dude. Oh, what the dick, there's another one. There's I know. two. Oh. <laughs> Did you see my, oh my gosh, there's a, oh, that's a bass. That's a bass right there. Oh, okay, yeah, don't shoot him. Quack, 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 quack. Well, it's time to go check our catfish lines one more time, but did a lot of looking, a lot of missing. Got to see what it looks like with bright lights. And I actually saw a lot of bass, a bunch of bait fish I've never seen up that close at night. It's pretty cool. Dude, this one's Where's rocking. No, it's, no, it's going. Because this one had a lot of slack. Oh, true. Yeah. Yeah, we got a mover and a shaker here now, boys. We got mover and shaker. Yep. Okay. She bobbing. Up, oh, new chip. Back me up. All right, you're good. You're good. We got. Oh, dude, it feels heavy as hell. Hey, what we got? Kitty cat. Oh, dude, he just came off. No. Serious. Are you kidding me? He just came off. It was a kitty cat? Yeah, it was a kitty cat. Right when I was Dang. lifting it, bro. Sometimes it's oh, how she blows. More. There's so many ducks on the water, it's hard to tell. Right here, wasn't it? Yeah, I felt like it was right here. Or did something massive just take it under? I just don't, it was, dude, what is that? What is that? What the heck is that? Dude, what in the world? Is that a person? I think it's a person. Huh? Dude, what? On what? I'm so confused. <laughs> what is that, dude? What is that thing? What was that, bro? How could it be moving that quick? Yeah. And there was mo no motor noise. I know you guys didn't see that, but we just saw a Sasquatch on the water. <laughs> and one of our, our last jug is missing. Something big could have gotten it. Sasquatch. I think something took it, man. Almost down. It took it down and it wasn't able to pop back up because it got tangled. Whew. That looks like a UFO coming in right there. Oh yeah. <laughs> and that Fishing Freaks was my first bow fishing experience at night under the lights. Literally a different look at the lake. Really cool, you can see bass swimming around 
other species. I've never done crappie that way either, like at night. Um, we saw some people using underwater lights too for, I mean, I'm assuming, crappie. Pretty cool. If you would like to see a nighttime crappie fishing video, let me know in the comments. So we only ended up with one buffalo and we had two catfish on. We lost one. One's in the cooler right now, ready to clean. It's been sitting on ice overnight. But if you, any of y'all want to use your leftover carp or buffalo as catfish bait, almost all the baits were taken, like eaten off of the hook. So it definitely worked as catfish bait. Man, guys, I'm just getting older by the day, staying up. I mean, we were only out there till like midnight. I used to night fish till like three or four in the morning and then get up and function the next day. It is, it is rough, but the fishing game must go on. Hey, guess what we're doing next? We're going crappie fishing, y'all. So we've been in Outlaw's boat. Love having him here because he's got a, a whole different vessel. We can get a whole different kind of dangle in. But now it's time to load up in the new Silver Bullet and we're gonna, we're gonna take them out and go crappie fishing, maybe do a little bass fishing. Y'all, it's gonna be a good time. So subscribe if you haven't already. If you wanna stay tuned for more dangles and I'm wishing you all the best in your outdoor adventures coming up. God bless you. We'll see you soon.